Um, Erling didn't score tonight, and it feels like when Erling doesn't score, there isn't quite the support from the rest of the players backing him up this season. Um, yeah, he's the main target, but uh, Phil had two or three clear chances, and Josko had one or two clear chances. So uh, I don't know how to review the game, but the fact that the way we played in different shapes in the first or second half, the way with the baller playing was good. I don't think we didn't create not enough chances. We create a lot of chances, but it's true that in our way, we are there, and after you know they link there, they son keep the ball or Skuluseski contact inside, and after run, if we don't win these first actions, it's more difficult. And they were brilliant; they were good, so you have to accept it. Do you need more players to kind of step up and take some of the goal scoring responsibility with Erling? Yeah, maybe, yeah, but I, I don't think it's a way to create. The chances are there. So the same like uh, like for example in a in Brighton, but that is where it is. It's where it is. Of course, we want a lot of players to score, but it's yeah, it's um, it's happened now. So w w I think we had the chances and l clear, clear ones with zero, with zero zero with zero one with zero two. We were there, and I know Etihad when when we are there, we can score goals. Our momentum is there, but. Now in that moment we are not we are not solid enough. That is the truth. So in both sides, normally we're solid, but we could see the goals. No, in both sides we are not we are not good enough. When you um, were talking about the new contract with the club and when you signed it, did you think that there would be um, looking to the future there would need to be a degree of rebuilding of the squad? to change it over, over the period of time. I think the squad, when all the squad is there, is exceptional. I would not be, for my boys, that or my word, that the team is not good. But the team is not ready here. It is a little bit the problem that we have in this period. But the team is really good. And at the end of the season or whatever, of course, like I'm here and I want to be, we will take the right decisions, what we have to do. but. Uh, looks like when I'm saying that, I trust more than ever with these players. So I've been here as a football player, you have doubts, and you want to win, and they are desperate to do it well. They are not, eh, it doesn't matter. Absolutely not. I see them every day training session, how they are focused today in the in the locker room, in the in the warm-up, and after the game, and how, how they feel it. They feel it. The football players, not just here and everywhere, they feel it. They want to do it well. But sometimes you have to accept it, sometimes... Yeah, it's not like we have been eight years, but I said I said before and I said I said I said here, so sooner or later should have happened. Sooner or later. I know that people win again and again and again. Sooner or later you have that for many reasons, little details. It's not about we'll be said, oh that is the reason why, me or players or I don't know, whatever. Uh, we'll need to fix it. There are little 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 things to start Wrong for the beginning of the season, and it was getting worse, a little worse in situations. And I say, no, the squad, the squad is really good. When we are all together, it's really, really good. But unfortunately, then uh, now you have to face it. So we c I cannot say anything. So, so with the situations, what you have to do? Keep going, my friends. Keep going, keep going. We have done it in the past, in terms of being not as bad as now in terms of results. But we have done it, and we face the situation, and we move forward. Last two with Jack and Sam, please. Hiya, Pep. Um, you mentioned before that the negative thoughts inside the players' heads, which is natural if you've lost four games on a trot. How, as a manager and a coaching staff, do you go about working on that in the week? Do you have? Is it a case where maybe you don't see each other as much? Well, as a normal season, when they are lazy or they don't care, and after that, I have to be there. But when I know they try it, and when I try it, I'm there. I'm there in a good way, so they don't want to leave. I never saw a football player, never ever in my life, uh, that they want to perform bad. They don't want, uh, you know, make a bad performance for his family, for his mates, for the fans, for for the club. Is there? Nobody wants it. When a player go there in front of sixty thousand people, they want to perform well. But sometimes, for many reasons, uh, it hurts. It's more difficult. And is it just a is there a slight problem with reacting to adversity in games? I know we've spoken about this already this season. It's sort of when the team goes behind, that maybe a few heads drop. 
Listen, when you lose your four, all the all the comments that uh, miss this, miss that, miss this, yeah, can happen. <laughs> we can, yeah, it's true. So, uh, but uh, I don't have the feeling with zero one. We react really bad on the second half with zero three. Was our best moments until the last moment that we concede the fourth. I think the team was uh, was good, but and it created the chances. We were there, but unfortunately, we could not do it. Last one, sir. Hi, Pep. You've talked about the first actions and the, the duels and the second balls, not just in this game, but after a lot of games. And obviously, the teams you're playing against are good. But also, S City need to be good, need to be better in those actions. What is what has been the problem there? Is it some? Is it the, the knock-on effect of the injuries? Is it something the squad doesn't have without Rodri and, and now Kovacic as well? Is it something that you might need to get from outside? Is it something you can get from the players you've already got? Of course, the presence from, from central defenders with their feet, with Rodri, of course, with Kova, with his pace, of course. But of course, it's completely different than the other one. But you have to deal with that. That Rodri had to deal with that type of game, you know, and more and more control or more these kind of things. Yeah, but during the seasons, it happened. We don't expect to lose important players from many, many, many times, but it's happened. You have to find a way. When I start to lose, I said to the people, I have to find a way. I have to. It's my duty, my responsibility, to find a way to be more consistent and our game will be better and win games. And it is, uh, it is what they have to do. Do you think the players in the squad at the moment have got that ability to, to win those duels again? We have to find another, another abilities. If we don't have this one, you have to find another way to win it. So sometimes when you don't have it, put the reasons, because for many reasons, it doesn't matter. We have to do it, so in, in another way. And which players we have at our disposal? These ones are better than the other ones? Okay, let's go and let's try to, you know, to do it in, in, with, with them uh, for the potential, the qualities that we have. And that is what we have tried to do, and um, we are thinking for the last, last weeks. Thank you. Okay, everyone. good night.